YouTube's desktop appearance could be changing in the near future, and this is how to get your own very sneak peek. YouTube can be sneaky at times, and this latest secret hints at a new design layout that will look similar to the material design style you might be familiar with on smartphone Google applications. So here's your chance to get ahead of the game and prepare your channel for what it might look like in the future on a desktop computer. And here's how to do it. You need to start by going to the Chrome Settings button and clicking New Incognito Window, as this can't be done when you are logged into YouTube. In the new Chrome browser window, go to the web address displayed on screen now. A direct link is provided in the video description. So far, YouTube looks normal, but here's where we're going to shake things up. Go to the Settings button again and go to More Tools and then click on Developer Tools. Where the Developer Tools appear at the bottom of the browser, go to the Resources tab and then click on Cookies, followed by the YouTube link. When the cookies appear on screen, you need to delete the visitor underscore info one underscore live cookie by right clicking on it and deleting it. Once you've done that, click on the console tab in the developer tools and then paste in the following line of syntax. This syntax is provided in the video description so you can copy and paste it easily. Press enter and then reload the web page and YouTube will start to look a little different. Go to your channel page and then it will start to look a lot different but familiar at the same time. And that's because it's material design on your desktop YouTube channel page. It's not confirmed yet whether this is an official new desktop layout, but if it is, here's your sneak peek. And let me know if you like it or do you prefer YouTube's current layout. Now while you may have to wait a while for this design to be officially unveiled, you don't have to wait another second to start taking advantage of vidIQ's suite of video creating tools for YouTube. There's tons of features including individual video scorecards, social media analytics and video tools to help you copy cards and annotations, create thumbnails and even post your YouTube videos directly to Facebook. It's free to join so head on over to the website to start YouTubing the smart way.